yeah, you're going to have some frustration. Now, he's got to learn how to recover and be a better teammate and what and whatnot under those situations. And that's the reason why I think him being here in the Carolina Panthers, having a guy like Adam Thielen in the locker room, um, exactly. in the position in the, in the locker room, um, that's going to be able to help him grow as an individual, as a professional. And so I'm not too worried about it. I'm excited to see him, um, you know, dress up in that Panther uniform and be a jitterbug. That's it, that's the exact point I was going to bring up, Stu, is like, and, and I'm not a, a Steelers encyclopedia, of course, but I think the situation that he was in in Pittsburgh, it was always – he was kind of thrown into the mix right away when he came into the league, and they kind of leaned on him and some other young guys. They never really had that true veteran. And then they bring in George Pickens, who's, you know, top draft pick, and all the attention is going to him. I can understand that because – when you bring in a new guy, it, yes, it's not really to replace Deontay, but it could be taking away some of that attention or some of those those looks or targets. Yeah, there's only one ball. When, when you don't have somebody to really groom and develop you, that could be a part of the reason he went through those bumps. And now he's coming to Carolina where he can live right here under Adam Thielen's wing and just – if, if I'm Deontay Johnson this offseason, I'm moving into Adam Thielen's house.